Welcome back. Um, I've noticed in the world that people are not very nice to disabled people. I'm not that disabled, first of all. I only have hemiplegia, not that bad. Um, I got a whole side that works. And what I, what I always tell people is like, you really only need one hand, one good leg. You can do anything, you, can, you got it. Anyway, I've noticed that people think that I'm supposed to be stupid or something. So whenever I go in to like go do something, they they treat me like like I'm like a three year old that doesn't know what he's doing. I know what I'm doing, okay. First instance, I was walking to the store to get some coffee, and it was my turn to go. This lady almost hits me with her car, and then she has the audacity to look at me like I'm doing something wrong. It was my green light to go so then I kind of I I got angry so I was like what the hell are you doing and then she's like mm -mm, mm -mm. she wouldn't even talk she had a mask on in her car and um you just look dumb she was alone in her car with a mask on who are you trying to protect yourself from the air conditioning um you know I thought that was mean and then my mom was like because my mom was with me and she's like you don't need to get so angry. And I'm like, I'm tired of people being rude to me. I'm tired of it. I don't want to deal with it. I don't want to deal with it. So I'm not going to. Um, and then I was at the pharmacy a couple of weeks ago before the, the corona hit like a major tidal wave. And I went to go pick up something at the pharmacy. And this guy was behind me. And he's like, you're not standing close enough to the counter. I'm like... First of all, what makes you think that you can tell me what to do? Um, he left me alone. I was like, dude, you need to leave me alone, okay? I'm just trying to get my damn medicine. And I'm gonna leave. Stop telling me what to do. People expect me to just be submissive and be like, oh, yep, I'm disabled. I, I can't do anything. But they're, what they're not expecting is that I'm smarter than they think I am. So they need to leave me alone. And then the, the third thing, the third thing that really just was not cool was I went to go pick up something at the store. It was an online order. I had it all, I had it all set up. And then when I went to the place, it was in a different spot. So I had to figure out where the spot was to pick it up. So there was a lady outside and she was directing people. So I was like, hi, I have my mask on and everything six feet away. And I was like, hi. Is this where I pick up my order? She's like, online orders only. And I'm like, it wasn't even like a hello, hi. Yes, this is the place. It was online orders only. And I was like, okay, I have one. Give it to me. Give me my online order. All right. I think they see the hand and then they see the way I walk and they're like, oh, he doesn't know what he's doing. We can just push him around. Like, stop trying to push people around. Get over it. I got this. Okay? I'm done. <laughs> A little rant. Because I don't I don't know what else to say. Because it's very boring in quarantine. I'm just going to say that right now. It's very boring. Um, if, you know, if you want to hear me rant about something else, let me know in the comments. You can like this video. You could subscribe to the channel. Or... You could do all three. Uh, until next time. See you later. It's all about you.